These guys have got to be nuts, especially the ones doing the acrobatics on the chair. Their destiny is 70% controlled by the man at the helm. It's got to be a perfect combination of balance and coordination between the rider and the passenger. some of the outfits have sidecars on the left and some on the right. The reason being that the Continentals drive on the right and the English drive on the left hand side of the road. Bruno Czechoslovakia. It's a very hot day out there and Agostini has obviously been keeping cool in the shade of the pits until the very last moment while all the other riders sweated out on the grid in their hot leathers and helmets. adopted in the last 10 years by practically everybody but nobody yet has been able to come up with a satisfactory explanation for this but I think it is uh, for keeping the very fine balance which is needed in the corners Wow, that's gonna hurt Woo, I'm sure he was going much too fast to know what was happening there but he still had his wits about him and even before the machine had stopped spinning he's on his feet and waving to the other riders to slow down Boy, I'll bet that shook him up a bit. This is Jano Serenum from Finland. 
Before he took up road racing, he was Finnish ice and sand racing champion, which has obviously stood him in good stead in his new career. Normally, when a machine starts to slide, you get into a bit of a panic and either fall off or get very upset. But Jano just winds it all on and collects it in the way he goes, without even giving it a thought. This makes him especially good in the rain. I nearly, I saw when I got gas, he was going very slowly. Yeah. I think he's clutchy, he had a clutch. Yes, yeah, I think he's, yeah. I nearly hit his bike. Yeah. He came forth to the drawbacks and then middle and second. And here's Phil Reed, also riding an Augusta. Thank you very much. How was it? Was it rough in the last one for you? Oh, the 350 was hard. I never want to ride that hard again. That's mad, it's mad this track here. Why is it better? Why? Why was it better? Bad. You go so fast, hey, he rides it like a short circuit. Kelly the bros, for this. What for? And the brothers for my 250. Yeah, yeah, I had to open it now. But it's okay, it's okay. It's okay. <laughs> Ego is always very patient and he'll sign autographs until the cows come home. again in first place. This is incredible after such a high speed spill in the previous race. He must be feeling very, very sore and stiff and certainly not at all like trying to win another race. You see that knee going in and out again, maintaining that very fine balance in the corner. I've been racing now for many years and I know what it takes to become world champion in this highly competitive and dangerous sport and I would like to say that Giacomo Agostini is a very worthy champion having displayed everything that has been required of him in doing his job.